And welcome to Friday Night Backlash episode number 24. In our first matchup, is a career threatening match. If Cody Rhodes and Christian lose this matchup, they are gone from AWWE for good. And where would that leave the industry? It would leave only CM Punk and whoever he chose to be a second in command since the show McCool quit a while back after she lost to Shigo at Queens of Extreme in an interview after the matchup that wasn't on YouTube or the internet for that matter. I might put it up as a classic EWE. Classic EWE Current reigning EWWE Tag Team Champions, the Ministry of Destruction, Giant Gonzalez and Bane. Giant Gonzalez also a psycho champion. I think it was hard for him. He even held that title for a very long time. He's the longest reigning hard for him. And then on top, Liu. And here comes Cody Rhodes. I really feel bad for Cody Rhodes to be put in this match up here. It's the opening match of the show, and he may lose his career on the opening match. They bet Cody Rhodes and Kristen better have something up their sleeves like they did last time. With the fake Gonzalez. That's the only way I can think that Cody Rhodes and Kristen can actually beat them. Let's just hope that this isn't a fake like last time. Cody Rhodes and Kristen are still feeling the battle effects from apocalyptic randomness. If you remember back then, back then in apocalyptic randomness, Believe it was pretty much interesting. We got decimated by Jack Gonzalez and Bane. Bane almost broke Christian's ribs like he did to John Cena, which forced him to retire. And yes, John Cena's retired. Another person you may not know is has now retired officially is HBK Shawn Michaels. He's gone as well. We're losing a lot of actual wrestlers here. Like there's a new opportunity to more CAWs. The winner of those tournaments gets to get a spot on the EWWE roster and then Jack Gonzalez is slamming Cody Rhodes down. Oh, and a clothesline in the corner. Oh, what a minute, Cody Rhodes moved. Drop kick. Oh, he drop kicks him into the corner. Cody Rhodes is... Oh, wait. John Gonzalez. John Gonzalez countered that. Wait a minute. Cody Rhodes with the counter. And he's going to suplex Bane inside the ring. But oh, Gonzalez from behind is slamming his knee into the back of Cody Rhodes' skull. Then tosses him out the ring. Tags in Bane. Now Bane going to return the favor, suplexing him back inside. And 
have the butt heads being bust up on that one. Oh, wait a minute. I thought he was going to go for a drop kick, but I said he was, but man. Moved out of the way. And, oh, and then just spears him off. Oh, and then high knee to, a high knee to Christian. And then, not, and then knocks Christian off the apron. Cody Rhodes maybe maybe thinking about staying staying away. And he gets back in the ring. Oh, and he tries to run him back and bang, and that's not a good idea. Oh, he's raked the eyes of Bane in the clothesline. And with that mask on, it's not a full mask. And a drop kick takes Ben off of his feet. Another drop kick. And a snap suplex. Oh, and a shot to the arm of Bane. And a clothesline knocks him right out the ring. That's surprising. Now wait a minute, and Cody Rhodes going flying! All the way to the outside, and then a knee right to the face of Bane. Bane's in a little bit of trouble here, then gets slammed into the ring post. Cody Rhodes slams his face into the ring post, and gets inside. There are count outs in this matchup. Just so no wep- and disqualification, so no weapons will be involved. That's green wood. Oh, a beautiful disaster! Cover! One, two, and no! That beautiful disaster kick almost ended it. Cody, oh, Cody, Cody Rhodes. Can't walk correctly. I think his knee hit off that metal mask of Bane. It looks like he was running and then ran into the ropes by accident. It's the effect of his knee giving out, though. Oh, and now Bane on the attack, just delivering square right hands to the face. And look out, look out. Oh, man. Bane, that was devastating. Oh, and that was even more devastating. The Dominator has the headlock. Oh, no, yeah, I take it back. This is more devastating. Just attacking the leg of Cody Rhodes. Oh, and Cody Rhodes going behind. Going behind Bane in a Russian leg sweep. Oh, and a schoolboy. Schoolboy cover one, two, and no. I was close. He almost, he almost rolled up Bane there. He got the victory. It was not to be his Bane back on the back on the attack. Suplexes him back inside. And Bane, oh, and there's that side side slam. He tags in Gonzalez. Drop toe hold into an elbow drop. You've seen that a million times, haven't you? 